Hi guys, my name is Rosina. My fiance and I own the Batchy Brew coffee truck and now the Batchy Brew coffee trailer or Batchy Brew 2.0. I just wanted to give you guys an update of how the trailer build is coming. We have less than 30 days to get this baby done. So I just wanted to give you guys a quick update and a little tour. If you haven't watched a previous video of ours, this is our coffee trailer. It's a 2021 covered wagon car trailer blackout edition we already cut the serving window in that did not come with the trailer when we bought it we had to buy a window and install it ourselves so the back door that's where the car would go in if we were putting a car in there but clearly we are not doing that so good morning i'm in my sweats so that's what she looks like <clears throat> let's go in all right so i apologize about the mess and that the lighting is not the greatest in here because i'm not opening the back door but just to give you a gist of the trailer i'm going to start with the left side my left side so obviously the hand washing sink and the serving window and then we decided to do an under counter refrigerator because it's just much easier to store stuff down there and we can grab things as we need to at the window and then also next to this fridge we are going to be putting another fridge there because we have just one fridge in the coffee truck and, and it's just not enough space because we just go through so much milk and especially oat milk seems to be a popular alternative. And then over here, so we have the main strip and on this side there is going to be the ice machine that we got and then here this is the ice bin and we got a fresh water spout so instead of having to use jugs of water we are going to be using the fresh water spout which we will connect to our filtration system which will filter the water as well for the espresso machine and the brewer so that will be lovely just so we can have fresh cold water on hand and then next to it is the pitcher rinser and then if you've watched my previous videos of the tour of the coffee truck, you probably noticed that there is a lot more spacing in between here, which is really, really nice. So we did take in consideration things that we can improve from the coffee truck and to improve into the coffee trailer. So I'm super excited for how much more space there is to make drinks because it's very limited on the truck. And then we have our second espresso machine. This is, again, the La Spaziale S2 two-group head espresso machine. We bought this machine used as well, and we absolutely love this machine. It's such a workhorse. So we're glad that we're able to get something that our employees are already familiar with, and then also we're familiar with it too, if we have to fix anything or so on and so forth. And then here where this vacuum is, that is where the knock box is going and then also the espresso grinder, the Malconig espresso grinder, and then also the decaf espresso grinder. So that's pretty self-explanatory in that space. And then over here we have our coffee brewing station. And obviously this is the coffee brewer. I have to order the gourmet stainless steel basket because the one that comes with this brewer is not enough for specialty coffee because it will overflow if we use that so i have to special order that basket and then we have our coffee grinder and obviously we use this to grind our beans for hot coffee iced coffee and then we also make cold brew grounds with this coffee grinder so very versatile and we love it and then somewhere over here 
here we're gonna have a stainless steel bench and this is most likely where the blender is going to go that we will get down the line and then also coffee air pods will go there because on the coffee truck there is another countertop that was like behind us that we could use but obviously we don't have that in here so just getting a stainless steel countertop would be nice also we can like store stuff on like the bottom shelf of the worktop so that will be nice so these are all the upper cabinets that are going to go above the machinery eventually but ryan needs to tile the wall with the backsplash that we got and it's the same as the coffee truck backsplash with the black subway tile and it's a it's a peel and stick tile excuse me and then over here our fresh water tank is gonna go somewhere over there we got that custom ordered so we're still waiting for that to come in our gray water tank will be mounted under the coffee trailer I'm honestly not too sure how big of sizes um, Ryan ordered so I apologize I'm not really keen on all the measurements and numbers for the build and then over here we have the three compartment sink obviously to wash rinse and sanitize our dishes at the end of the day we have a on-demand hot water heater and then we're waiting on drying racks to come in that i ordered off of amazon that we are just screwing to the wall so that's pretty much it guys we really enjoy the spacing in the trailer just because the trailer is a little wider so we're not going to be bumping butts as much with each other, which is really nice. And hopefully we can establish a better workflow in here. All right, guys, I think that's it for today. Make sure to follow us on social media and keep updated with the rest of the build.